right, man, we're back at Akihabara. Again, the anime capital of the world. Uh, everything to do with cosplay. There's the main girls right there, doing the biz. Another one. There's another one right there, right with Nathaniel right here. They're doing the biz. That's what that is. Guess this, please don't touch. They need, they need a break right now. Oh, wow. Look at you, Nathaniel. Oh, man! Look at this. Welcome. Got Nathaniel over there, but you got all this product placement of all these different signs. You've got the uh, Otomai, Olive Spa, you've got a bunch of stuff that makes no sense. And you've got, you know, different, looks like department store and fashion uh, advertisements all on these big, huge billboards and lights. Kid right there with the panda. Got people here eating, getting some food outside. Up above is the uh, the uh, subway. Up there, got some ladies right there just staring at us. Uh, looks like a Chinese restaurant right here where people are waiting in line to get something to eat real quick. Thanks. Look at this place, nice and flashy. That's right. Just sitting here at the corner and have the subway going by and play some J-pop. Looks like different marketplaces and stuff, but everything seems to be closed down. But it's spooky. Yeah. Yeah, it looks like it's a little bit more of a... Horror-ish. Shady, shadier side. It looks like more of a shadier side right here. Kind of dark, not very lit. Got a lot of advertising up here. I would definitely consider this more of the seedier side of Tokyo right here. This is a lot of establishments of, I guess, uh, I should say almost like escort services, um, strips, clubs, uh, things like that. Things where I'm looking at the annual going. Don't even, don't even ask. Please, please don't ask. All right. After going through a seedier part of town, which has a lot of nefarious activities, also an Oriental massage parlor right here. Here's our place right here. The Capsule Hotel, 24 hour, the new century. Um, that's after Google went over, Google Maps went and uh, basically gave me a complete grand tour of this whole place at least three times. Well, let's go check it out and see how this is and get some sleep. Sitting here in downtown Tokyo right here. Going to be going over to the Tokyo station. Too bad there's so much construction going on, but right here behind me, right there, that's old Tokyo Station. Look at that thing. That thing definitely stands out weird, doesn't it? I mean, with all the other stuff here, this thing, geez, look at that. Looks like it should be like in Europe or, or something like that, with all this architectural design work, the domes on top and such, the clock tower. But uh, this is the, one of the most busiest, busiest train stations in the world right here. Well, we walked into the dome of the uh, Tokyo train station. If you can see this, though. this place is something else. This is the dome right here. Wow. What do you think of this dome in there? Jeez. Oh, 
we're over here at Akihabara Station, and Nathaniel doesn't really know where we're going. It's kind of a secret. All right, man, we're back at Akihabara. Again, the anime capital of the world. Uh, everything to do with cosplay, everything to do with pop culture. It's here. I mean, look, we've got sexy little anime girls singing on a microphone for what reason, I don't know. We've got half naked whatever girls fighting personal wars. And we got now school girls all with glasses and stuff, you know. It's all sexualized. Over here we've got everything and anything to do with electronics. You want electronic devices and stuff. Over here parts, doodads, flashies, probably USB ports, everything you can think of. Computer fan central, look at that. Everything computer fans. These are the Japanese ambulances. Should start talking to us in a minute. Well, he wants to be really nice and quiet today. Mostly they'll sit there and they'll talk to you. There's the main girls right there doing the biz. Another one. There's another one right there, right with Nathaniel right here. They're doing the biz. There's another one right here. There's another one right there doing the biz right there. Right there. Right there. Yeah. There you go. What? Didn't need an organ harvest. Okay, why not? Let's just do it for it. She's got me to sign to ban organ harvesting. Why? I, I don't know. I mean, I guess if my kidney goes out or, or anything like that, I'd, I'd like to have somebody make a new kidney. All the people back home, man, you gotta see this truck. I mean, we need we need our trucks to look like that. I think it's a pretty, pretty cool looking truck right there, if I may say. It's a concrete truck, too. Kinda puts ours to shame. How it's covered in chrome. It's all shiny. I mean, if you look at the thing, it doesn't even have a speck of dust on it. The thing's amazing. Dang, look at, the, look at this it. thing. Look at that thing. Everything on it is shiny. Should we Kevin in the family? an owl on her head. Jeez. Look at these guys. Wow. What you doing, guys? Look at him. Wow. He's pretty. Are you giving him a break right now? Oh, yeah, the pink. They need a break. That's what that is. Yes, this please don't touch. They need, they need a break right now. Oh wow. Look at you, Nathaniel. This guy is a real owl. He's scratching. All these guys over here, they're all sleeping. Sleeping. Look at this guy, the president. Jeez. That guy's, he's awesome. What do you think, Nathaniel? Oh, he just got a little one. Oh, jeez, little guy. <laughs> just a little guy. Okay, we just left 
the Owl Cafe, and I'm gonna tell you what, that place, that place was awesome. Where you could just tell, you could tell how much fun we were having. Nathaniel over here, he stayed and he thought it was even better than the Hedgehog Cafe that we went to. So that right there, that was, that was awesome, man. That was, that was, that was, a, that was like a once in a lifetime, unless you come back here and then it'll become a twice in a lifetime <laughs> experience. Tokyo Dome. Going to Tokyo Dome. It's going to be the Giants versus the Dragons. All right, there it is, right there. Tokyo Dome. Where's the dome? Look at this. Jeez. Look at these people. These people are crazy. It's like a big old tower that people go up and then parachute uh, down, man. Look at that. Hey, John, look at how high that building is. Yeah, that's a pretty high building, man. Oh, there's the dome in front of us, Nathaniel. There's the dome. Whoa! Look at this thing. It's a, it's a dang regular amusement park. We've got a big old crazy roller coaster and everything here, too. Look at that. Look at this. Breaking through the archway. Look at that for you. Woo! Look at that guy. Look at that. There you go. There you go. There they go. Are they going to go, go through a big loop or something? Is that a big loop? Whoa! So I guess they call this area right here, they call this Tokyo Dome City. Just basically, it looks like a giant strip mall here with all kinds of food. You've got amusement park rides here, and then you've got the actual Tokyo Dome. Let's see some Japanese baseball. That's right, got your merchandise. See, there they are. That's the Tokyo Giants ones, so if you want those, or if you want, okay. yeah. it's a gun. So you go over and do that. Oh, there's the dragons. They're blue. Oh, man! Look at this. Whoa. Look at this. There's all the guys over. Hey. Woo! Look at this. That's definitely over there, the dragons. Cheer sec. See the beer girl? There's the beer girls. Right there. She just runs around and giving you beer. Yep. That's what I'm talking about right there. These guys, man, these guys are something else. Playing with these big old banners and flags. What do you think of this banner? It's crazy. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Offering your help. Premium deer. Ah, my favorite right there, the premium. How does it taste? Like heaven. 
Can you let me sit for a minute and think about it? Yeah, I come So, I guess the Giants lost by one point, but uh, Nathaniel over here, he uh, was your team, your team was the Dragons, so the Dragons won, but uh, yeah. it definitely, that was, a, that was quite of an experience seeing these guys, you know, rooting and chanting and hollering the whole time, hitting drums, you know, using bugles and stuff like that, the whole time cheerleaders, they've never seen cheerleaders in baseball, but uh, that was, a, that was quite an experience. What they refer to as the Tokyo Art Highway. Quite a quite a little tunnel, if I would say. It's like we're in a skeleton version of space.